Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be showing how you can create a Ubuntu droplet on DigitalOcean. So without wasting any time, let's get started. Let me quickly open a browser window and maximize it. As you can see, I'm already logged in. If you are not logged in, just go ahead and log in with your credentials. If you do not have an account with DigitalOcean, you can create an account using my referral link you will find in the description so that you can get 100 USD which you can use within 2 months. Once you are logged in, just click on droplets in the left menu. Then simply click on create droplet. Now we'll choose a droplet image. I'll be choosing the Ubuntu 22.04 LTS image. Then we'll select a plan. You can choose anything you want. But I'll go with the basic plan. Next we'll select CPU options. For example, we can select the premium AMD with NVMe SSD or Intel with NVMe SSD or we can go with the regular with SSD. So I'll just select this one and choose a monthly plan. Next, we'll select a data center region. So, I'll be selecting the Frankfurt data center. Then, we'll choose the authentication type. You can select SSH keys or password. In this case, I will go with the password authentication. So, just type in your password. Make sure you fulfill all the requirements. Then, we can select additional options but I will not be selecting anything from here. Next in the finalize and create section, we can choose how many droplet we want to create. And also you can rename the host name if you want. So I will rename it to Ubuntu 22. Then we can add tags so that we can easily find this droplet afterwards. I will go with Ubuntu 22. You can add as many tags as you want. Then you can select project. Since this is the first project, I will keep everything as default. Then simply click on create droplet. As you can see a droplet is being created. This is the public IP4 address of this droplet. If we click on this droplet, we can see all the details of this droplet. So let me copy the IP4 address. Now I'll open a terminal using spotlight search. Inside the terminal, I'll quickly type in ssh root at and then I'll paste the IP address I just copied. Then press enter. To accept the fingerprint, just type in yes and press enter. Type in my password. As you can see, we are logged into our Ubuntu droplet we just created. Now we can perform any operations we want. Let me close this H top window. So this is how you can create a Ubuntu droplet on DigitalOcean. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.